Hey YouTube, this is BrickBuilder011, and today I'm going to be coming at you guys with uh, another uh, LEGO Series uh, minifigure review. And uh, this time it is on the Series 8 minifigures, and uh, this is uh, the first Series 8 minifigure review I have done. It is a, it's a fairly new, um, fairly new uh, set of minifigures. As you can see, there is 16, as always. Uh, I, if you remember, uh, I did the uh, previous ones on some Series 6 and Series 5. Uh, or actually, these are Series 7. Sorry, I missed out on Series 6, so I'm sorry I didn't get any of those reviews out. But uh, these are fairly new, and uh, I know some people have wanted some reviews on uh, the Series 8 minifigures, so uh, I decided um, I would do a review on one. So, um... Uh, before we start off, I have a couple of things to say. Uh, I'm hopefully going to be uploading a lot more videos lately. And uh, check out my uh, update number four video um, for more information on that and what kind of videos I'm going to be uploading lately. Uh, secondly, if you hear any a little bit of background noise in the background, uh, my sister has a few friends over, so um, sorry uh, about that, but hopefully you shouldn't hear them. Um, then, uh, thirdly, I wanted to go over that, uh, this time I do have the paper, as you can see, uh, with all of the details, so this will be a uh, considerably longer minifigure review. So, uh, yeah, first off, let's start with the, um, sheet of, uh, information that it gives us. Okay, so up at the top left, you can see it says Series 8, and then Lego minifigures, and it has, uh, uh 8 over there in Spanish. And as you can see, we have all the different minifigures. I think this is a robot, a conquistador, um, I'm not sure, like maybe uh, like a German German uh, marketer or something like that. He looks German with the feather and holding the pretzel. Uh, like a cowgirl, a football player, um, like a, a deep sea diver, snowboard girl. Uh, businessman, a fairy, which I have, uh, Santa Claus, uh, like a bat, like a Batman, <laughs> um, not as in Batman, as in, um, from DC, but Batman, like, you know, <laughs> uh, a man who's a bat, it could be like a golem or something like that, we've got like a DJ, I think, he's got like a record disc, we've got a cheerleader, and then we've got like, um, I'm actually not sure if this is the conquistador or this guy, but I think it's this, uh, this guy, it could be this guy, got like, probably like another explorer, uh, a pirate, and then an alien, he's pretty cool. So, uh, yeah, and as you can see, there's, a uh, one, two, three, four, uh, up to sixteen, and, uh, so you can check off, uh, which minifigures you've received, and, uh, yeah, so that's the front, basically. Then on the back, as you can see, we have Lego minifigures, and then we have all the different helmets and how you would put the minifigure together. Uh, most of you, I hope, would know how to do this. Uh, if you don't, um, I recommend you figure out, because <laughs> uh, you're going to be having some trouble with Lego in general. <laughs> um, <laughs> either way, yeah. So that's the back. Shows you all the different accessories, skis, the like uh, leg pieces, torsos, and yeah, it's pretty much it for the back. So let's get on to the minifigure. Uh, as you can see, it's the fairy, and uh, this is one of those times where my camera is being nice to me, so yeah, it's going to focus. Okay, perfect. And as you can see, she's got some nice face de details, and uh, yeah. Um, yeah. So you guys can see her like there, and then you get this little plate with all the minifigures. You should all know that. And uh, it's for like displaying them on. Put that off the side. Now we're gonna take her apart and slowly put her together. And actually, you know what? Uh, I don't think I want to take her apart just because of these legs. Um, actually, I will take her apart. I'll show you guys. But uh, this is there's a very difficult part that I want to show you guys. Um, okay, got these. I think I'll try and keep them on. Okay, now you can see the legs have this little, like, um, this little dress that could possibly be, like, meant to be, like, a leaf, like a large leaf cut into little shards around her as a dress. Um, and then she just has bare, 
regular yellow legs. And she has like um, a little, she has little blue decals as part of her uh, dress um, under her legs, under the dress. And then I pop that on. Okay. You can see the rest of her dress. And uh, yeah, it's got like a flower at the top right, some nice like creases. And then the back is like, it's a very light, light blue, light tosh blue. And then um, that's that. And then we have these really cool wings, which are like not necessarily rubbery. They're smooth, very smooth to kind of stay in place wings. Now these are the first that I've ever seen with Lego come out of these sort of wings. And they're somewhat transparent. Um, and uh, yeah, they're pretty cool, in my opinion. And uh, they pop on her head like so. And then show her head. As you can see, she's got a little flower. Ugh. A little flower to the right of her face. She's, her lips are pink, and she's got like eyelashes. And uh, yeah, it's a fairly detailed head. And no, it's not double sided. I always like double sided uh, minifigures, but the wings make up for that in this. And we've got uh, a new hairpiece. Uh, that goes on like this with a little flick of hair at the front here and a little bun on top. And uh, yeah, it's like a light caramel brown color. Let me put this on. Sorry. It's kind of difficult to do it with one hand. I really need to get a different tripod for this camera. Um, but yeah, and then uh, we have the wings. Or not the wings. <laughs> the, uh, the wand, as you can see. And uh, it's also transparent and pink. A little girly for my liking. Um, uh, I'm not even gonna joke about that. Uh, I think Lego made this wand a little bit too girly. Uh, I'm not sure if this minifigure was aimed towards girls, so girls could get more out of a kick out of Lego series minifigures. I guess that's fair enough to say. There's a lot of man characters, but uh, actually in this, um, we've got what a cowgirl, a girl snowboarder, a fairy, a cheerleader, and then a lot of them are kind of like deformed, like robot and an alien and Batman don't really have a gender so yeah I'd say it evens out um but yeah either way uh, I think uh, Lego did a great job with the this review or <laughs> with this review oh my god my brain's just gargled today uh um it did a great job on this minifigure uh I definitely liked this minifigure uh I think I'm gonna give this set uh 8 out of 10, or 8 out of 10, just because I think they could have had um, a double-sided head and maybe some more tors details on the torso on the back, and then uh, besides that, everything's good, maybe the wand a little less girly, but yeah, besides that, uh, the attention to detail is great, and uh, I really, uh, really like the set, and I uh, hope you guys liked the review they did on it, uh, hopefully I'll be getting some more of these Series 7, or Series 8 minifigures. But uh, yeah, thanks again for watching, and uh, until next time, this is going to be uh, BrickBuilder011 signing out. Thanks for watching, guys. And until next time, see you guys later. Thanks, guys. Bye.